fame means nothing in these situations. Hey guys, I'm Rebecca from Watch Mojo, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 crazy Bear Grylls celebrity challenges. Before we begin, we publish new content every day, so be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. We've gathered the grossest, the most grueling, the most brutal examples of Bear Grylls testing celebs to their absolute limits. The British explorer is not afraid to get his hands dirty, or any other body part for that matter, so some of today's clips are actually pretty extreme, including some video of animal capture. Some viewer discretion is advised. Let's get to it. I've had a swim in this a lot. Have you? Uh, yeah, naked. Yeah. <laughs> That's not something we're gonna do either. No, no. Number 10. Courtney Cox, running wild with Bear Grylls. I wonder if that's what I'll be eating for dinner, what these sheep are eating. I'd prefer that than some of the things I've seen on the show, by the way. Good old grass wouldn't hurt anybody. While we know her best as the neat freak Monica from Friends, Courtney Cox proved she could rough it in the great outdoors when she teamed up with Bear in the Irish Highlands. This running wild episode sees Cox and Grylls fish a dead sheep from a nearby bog before cutting off its testicles and boiling up the maggots inside. The meat is obviously not very good. No. Yeah, you need to smell my hands. I, I, I smell it. It's good. Okay. Got it. But the maggots you can eat. It has to be one of the least appetizing meals we've ever seen, but Cox does muster a mouthful. It's an acquired taste, we're sure. The maggot, surprisingly, once you swallow a maggot and you drink water, it blows up, you know, kind of like dog food, and it feels like it really filled me up. That's why I didn't need any more but just the one. Number nine, Tom Evans, Celebrity Island with Bear Grylls. Can okay, I Tom? Get it beat, son. Tom, I swear to God. Hmm? Well, While our next entry isn't focused on a standalone challenge, when Tom Evans quit the first series of Celebrity Island in 2016, it highlighted how unforgiving a Bear Grylls show can be. So you are 82 kilos. What was you before? 94. 94. A former international rugby player and an ex Strictly Come Dancing contestant, Evans might have seemed like an ideal fit for the Extreme Endurance program. But he dropped out midway through after losing almost 28 pounds in a week. In fact, he was so exhausted, he could barely clamber onto the boat to take him home. Oh, bless him! Give him a sandwich! Woo! Give him a sandwich! Number 8. Channing Tatum, Running Wild with Bear Grylls. Good. Well, we got fire lighted. We've had a snack. Yeah. We're well on our way. This, is, this good. is good. I'm loving being around tiny little things that I can't see that can kill me. When this actor took a walk in the California woods with Bear, he threw himself into each and every task. But while we enjoy Tatum's daunting cliff climb, or the even hairier descent, his hunt for dinner is easily the most memorable part of this episode. Okay, Chan, get the weaponry. First off, Bear and Chan find a potentially fatal scorpion. Bear beheads it, they both eat it. Is the, Have you eaten the... scorpion before? No, never. Half each? Yeah, half each. Then they come across an angry snake, and Tatum has machete in hand. The movie star makes light work of the kill, and guts it for good measure. We're gonna cut it into onion rings, snake rings. Oh my god. Ready to eat. Mmm. Number seven, Mel B. Running wild with Bear Grylls. That's a jellyfish. Been washed up. Is it dead or is it alive? Well, it could sting you, right, if you touch it. If it's got tentacles like that, those are stingers. When Mel B and Grylls go hiking in Wales, they make the somewhat surprising discovery of a jellyfish caught between rocks. But while explaining the nutritional benefits of their find, things take a turn for the worse and Bear ends up with a sore hand. So those bits, I mean, it's, it's, the bits. it's slippery, but those are the... But all's not lost because Scary Spice hasn't peed for a while, and she volunteers her urine as an antidote. You have to see this to believe it. To pee on demand when somebody's in pain is very difficult. There we go. There we go. Number six, Zac Efron, running wild with Bear Grylls. See the little camoed up box? I do. That's our extraction. Under that is an ATV, and we're then out of here. All we've got to do is get down this last bit. And now to another actor who fully commits to everything Bear throws at him. 
Zac Efron proved his grit for the first ever episode of Running Wild. The high school musical star saved his best for last, though, when he and Grills negotiated a nerve-shredding 150-foot drop into remote waters just before reaching their extraction point. Are you yeah. ready? I am as ready as one, I'm gonna be, One man. last bag of fortitude. Let's do it, brother. Here we go. <laughs> Bear and Zack bred quite the bromance on their expedition, and they finished by beating this final obstacle together. Shirts were clearly optional. They tested every single facet. <laughs> Endurance, strength, willpower, fortitude, courage, and <laughs> I'm pretty stoked. Number five, Stephen Fry, Bear Grylls, Wild Weekends. My hope is that I will be a little bit more proud of myself at the end of it and at least feel that I've accomplished something. While Bear pushes all of this list celebs out of their comfort zone, few are forced further than Stephen Fry when he teamed up with Grills for a wild weekend in the Italian Dolomites. This is why they invented yodeling. The well-spoken comic was quick to confess his inexperience with outdoor adventuring but he still managed to helicopter in, abseil down a rock face, and sleep in an abandoned war trench. My god, I've never shaved in an environment like this. But the highlight has to be Steven scaling a 500-foot waterfall. He goes through all manner of emotions during the three-hour climb, but he is beaming when he reaches the bottom. That was probably the most exhausting thing I've ever, ever Done. Number four, Drew Brees, running wild with Bear Grylls. So the good news is I come around the corner, bam, perfectly camouflaged is a crock. And that for me means one thing, dinner. Stick an NFL quarterback in the Panama jungle and expect the unexpected. But Drew Brees went to untold extremes to keep his protein levels up when he and Bear came face to face with a crocodile. They are the ultimate stealth predators, these guys. So you get too close and they explode into power. While Grills distracts the croc by noosing its nose, it's down to Drew to capture it, which he does with surprising composure. There follows some pretty grim footage of the pair ending the predator's life and a slightly stomach-churning assessment of the kill, but Bear isn't fussy when it comes to food. But it is undoubtedly the fastest, most humane way you can do it. I'm straight through that spinal cord. Never pretty, but it means we can eat. Number three, Jake Gyllenhaal, Man vs. Wild. Jake! How you doing, Jake? Good. Yeah, what's it like down there? It's warm, but it smells like For one of Bear's earliest celeb collaborations, he and Jake Gyllenhaal head out to the Icelandic wilderness, and the Southpaw actor proves a prize fighter on tough terrain. Jake and Bear trek treacherous plains and dine on some questionable delicacies, but Gyllenhaal's greatest moment comes when crossing a ravine. Take your time, focus on the rope, don't let down. You're gonna be strong, all right. Despite perilous weather and a long-held fear of heights, Jake edges along a rope with spectacular views all around, but certain death if he falls. What a hero. Does it look quite high? Uh, yeah, it's uh, Pretty high. Number two, Michelle Rodriguez, running wild with Bear Grylls. I have some legitimate piss in here. That's my girl. As we've seen, dinner with Bear is rarely a mouthwatering prospect. However, Michelle Rodriguez's menu triggered new levels of nausea. The actress eats with Grylls on a rock in the Nevada desert, but all they've got to bite on is a dead mouse and nothing to boil it in. This is the part I dreaded. Don't mind trekking for hours in the hot sun. But the mouse, the urine and the mouse. Mm. That's real <laughs> special, Bear. So ever the opportunist, Bear gets Michelle to do her business and they stew the rodent in urine. Even Bear admits he struggled to keep this one down. And can you really blame him? So there have been a few occasions over the years where I've had to drink my own urine, you know, in a survival situation. But there's something about drinking somebody else's. I finally found the thing that has broken me. Mouse and somebody else's urine stewed. Before we unveil our number one pick, here are some honorable mentions. Things they're saying, don't do this, don't go over the edge. Human bodies are not meant to go over the edge. Oof. All right. Okay, loops in. Okay, go for it. Here we go. told me it was gonna be steep. He didn't tell me there was gonna be an arch or gonna put backpacks one side and then go off the other. Jeez. I'm a big believer in science. 
Yeah. Uh, and, uh, you know, when I started looking at the science, uh, it was indisputable. Okay. Oh, God, oh, my head. Oh, my God. Number one, Michelle Collins, Jason Gardner, Samantha Barks, and Alex Scott. Bear Grylls, mission survive. How can we make this water drinkable? Boil it. Boil it. But what happens if you're on your raft and you're out to sea and you can't make fire? Today's winner involves not one, but four famous people, all taking part in ITV's Mission Survive. Michelle Collins, Jason Gardner, Samantha Burks, and Alex Scott all drop their trousers for this one, but not before Bear bears it all to show them how it's done. Okay, rectal rehydration. That's what I'm going to do today with Bear. We'll show you guys how it's done. Ah, oh, I love my job. Not. Grills assures us that rectal rehydration saves lives, but there's little to save red faces here. Please, if you can look the other way, that'd be good. Can you feel it, right? Yes! A clip you just can't unsee, it's a literal bum deal. And reality TV at its weirdest. The thing is, it's been proven to save people's lives. It's helping you, it's rehydrating you. <coughs> Cough hard, let's extract. Well done, guys, great effort. I don't know about you, but I don't think I would go to a dinner party at Bear Grylls' house. And this list has pretty much confirmed that for me. Anyway, uh, be sure to like, subscribe, and check out these other videos that I'm assuming will be slightly more appetizing.